attention to this right now. City Council is debating Mayor Nutter's proposed FY 2011 budget. And if you've been following this, there are various proposals for increased trash fees, soda taxes, some are talking about raising the property tax, all to close a budget deficit. Others are proposing cost, cutting the cost of government. So the two-part question, the first part just as residents of the city, where do you stand, even though you don't get the vote on these, on some of those proposals in terms of raising money and cutting taxes and or cutting taxes? And then the second part of that question is your role as a legislator, or someone proposing to be in the state legislature. What do you see as the state, what could the state do here, particularly with a set of the county functions, which the city has to fund? I think, Bebe, you get yes. this one first. Yes. My feeling has always been that Philadelphia and other autonomous areas in the state ought to be left alone by the General Assembly to make their own decisions. So last, in the last phase of trying to um, close the gap, budget gap in the city, I worked very hard, strenuously hard, so that the proposed temporary increase in sales tax that the mayor and city council wanted could pass because in that case they needed our approval. I am not going to really put my foot into what is city council and the mayor's um, decision. But whatever they decide, and today I'm reading that city council is talking about a property tax again, in which case we may have a role to play depending on how it sets out. My role in Harrisburg is to advocate for Philadelphia, bring more money, more resources, more jobs, more services, and to keep the rest of the General Assembly from interfering with us. Great. Uh, Babette, I could not agree with you more. I think it is your role to bring more money that we are owed here in Philadelphia. In 1987, the Pennsylvania Supreme Court ordered our state government to fully fund Pennsylvania's unified, unified judicial system. That has not been talked about in a very long time until right now, because now we have this serious budget crisis. Here in Philadelphia, that is a hundred million dollar a year problem. Right now, we as Philadelphia taxpayers, because Philadelphia, the city, and the county are the same thing, are funding our own judicial system and we are spending $100 million a year funding our judicial system, even though the state should be funding that. My opponent is chair of the state government committee. Instead of actually using her authority as chair of the state government committee to try to leverage some of that power to make the, the, the state government fulfill its court-ordered obligation, she's literally holding hearings on the fact that there is a rodent problem in the Harrisburg cafeteria. That may be a problem, but it's not a priority. And frankly, it's a disgrace at a time when we have real problems right here in Philadelphia that you could be banding together with some of the other legislators from the Philly delegation and saying, we're gonna put our foot down and we're not gonna let another bill come through our committees until the, the, the state fulfills its obligation to fully fund the Philadelphia court system. 